Hello, my name is Smoothie Johnson, and I'm going to tell you about a pinball machine. Um, I made this pinball machine, and it was pretty simple for the launcher. The launcher just uses like a couple pieces, and then the rubber band was the most important part so you could stretch the pusher. So, the rubber band is most of the part. It's like you put a ball here, pull this back, and, and the rubber band is making it go back. And the pushes these bounce and then it makes it go different places and and it's it's coming this way it's so like this is the strongest part that can do it but then this is the hardest part to go up because this already pushed it and it's going down so that's easy but then this it has to go up, and then all, like, when you push it downhill, it will go really fast, and you can't even push it, and then it won't even get to this side. So, it's going to stay down. And I'm going to try out the white bowl and show you how it works. So, I'm trying to get, this is, um, this is one point, I mean, this is zero, yeah, this is one point. This is a lucky clover, then this is um, a 100 points, and then this is like 100 points, because I wanted two 100 points. And, and then when I push two balls, they kind of go at the same time, but then they just come back. Okay, so I got 100 points, and it bounced like this, and it came down here. And then some of the pressure went down on this, which, which did my finger, and then it made it bounce and then come down here. How did you build that? Um, I built it with concentration, and and so the bottom has some foam. I don't know why they put the foam on there, but but like the top was easy. You just have to put these gold things in and then put a washer sticked into it and then fold the two sides different directions and and that was like basically the whole thing but every single one was like on one was on one piece and and so I didn't do so I didn't do these ones yet. I didn't do these long ones. I just did the bottom part. This, and I also did this part, and then they're split apart, so I put them together, and then, and then put the long ones on, which makes them completely connect. The same with all the other ones. And then you're on to the obstacles. Okay, see you later. Hope hope you buy some Tinker Crates and Kiwi Crates and Doodle Crates.